All right, Gina Graham is with us from Creative Interiors. Love this segment. You're here every Thursday. <laughs> Love to talk about home interior stuff. And you got some really cool home stuff for us today. Yeah, this is a real unique um, situation we had. We had a customer that wanted, that saw a picture like in a magazine and wanted to replicate it, which happens a lot. Um, but what she did is she was building onto her house and as she built onto the house for the pool room, she wanted an extra bedroom. But they didn't have, they did, she didn't want doors or anything else. Um, and she wanted the whole thing fabric. So we did the fabric ceiling, we did the fabric walls, and then there was a window and we did fabric draperies and instead of a wall to go in and out, like having a door or drywall, you know, walls, we did a fabric wall that she opens and closes. So there's the first picture. So this is how we started and this is the ceiling. You've got the one window, that window looks out, the big long one looks out onto the pool. Okay. And then the long window there looks into the living room. So it's a little bit more long. Yes. Okay. Yes. And this is from the bottom. You're looking up into the ceiling because this is where the chandelier is going to go. We had to start on one side. We had to pleat the fabrics all the way up, and then we had to go to the next side. Oh, so you can see yeah. how it's kind of a long area there, and then that, right. that's kind of just a, I guess it's more of a rectangle room surrounded by windows on either side. And there we are putting up the centerpiece there. And you said it's a chandelier? Yes. So um, they did the medallion, and then the chandelier, the electrician, had to move the where the outlet was for it. Okay, so you can combine the fabric ceiling with a little bit of electrical, maybe kind of spruce it up and yeah. there we are covering most of it in fabric. How long does it take to pleat that fabric like that? Well, and this is something you had to do on site, so it's not something you can make ahead of time. Mm -hmm. And it took them um, most of the day to do just the ceiling. Um, and then after that, they had to put the rods all the way around the room. Okay. Uh, because they were drapery rods. See, there's okay. a rod behind the bed there. Right, and that's fabric. That's fabric, and that covered a window. Okay. And then there was um, more on the sides, on your right and left. Mm -hmm. There's more panels. Okay. There you go. And see, they're open there. They're open there, so you can let light in, kind of right. close it out if you need to. You said that one window overlooks the pool, so maybe if the kids right. are out having a, you know, they're all being loud, you can close the thing and kind of <laughs> yeah. shut them out for a while. Now, how would you care for that fabric? I mean, do you need to do anything special, maybe keep the dust off of it or? Um, yeah, you can um, just, I Run always. Run a vacuum maybe? You can do a vacuum, that Swiffer thing. Yeah, the Swiffer yeah. duster, those are really <laughs> yeah, handy. Those they are. Those are super are. handy. And yeah. so is this the fabric you this use here? This is the fabric. Okay. Um, this is the blue for the panels. Mm -hmm. um, this is the comforter we used, and I wanted to show that to you because you can't really get that in the picture oh, as well. it's very soft. Isn't that soft? Mm -hmm. So the whole room Warm was all too. blue, and this was just the one little piece that we accented with and part of the curtains and then part of the spread. Okay. So lots of fun colors. And so this is kind of for a smaller area now. Can you do fabric walls and ceilings for maybe a larger room? Oh yeah, and if you go around the corner of this room, there was a whole sliding glass door that went to the, out to the pool, and it was like a triple door, I think. So we did panels all along the wall to match this. Okay. Um, we didn't do the ceiling in that one because that was already coffered. Mm -hmm. uh, but. Yeah, we can uh, we can do any size. Yeah, y'all do really great stuff. That's really awesome. Well, mm -hmm. if somebody has any questions, maybe they're inspired to do something like this for their um, house, who do they contact or where can they get a hold of you? 781-7379, uh, and we're across from Greenwood High School. And check us out on our Facebook and our blog. Always got great ideas, and you can put your pictures up there. And yeah. this is absolutely wonderful. Thank you so much for joining us today. Thank you. All right, well, we'll be back with a look at your final forecast.